Let's go to task B. Anyone can begin. I would like to start the discussion by saying that um, peer, inf peer influence is, is the most important factor which contrib contributes to good performance in examinations. This is because peer influence can lead us towards a better, a better achievement in the study. When we, uh, when we have group discussion, that can there are many ways to uh, study together, like funny way and change the word into the lyrics so we can remember well and then the performance, the examination performance is uh, will improve. Do you agree with me? Can it be? I agree with you. I also think that parental support is the important way to contribute good performance in examination. Uh, I think that parents should, should fully support us for what we want to, uh, want to study. For example, they, should, they also can send us to tuition class to tuition the weaker subject. You can do it. We, this is because uh, parental supports will give us uh, more mor um, moral values and this can help to enhance us in start uh, enhance us um, mentally and physically in our studies. They will encourage us with some good words and not by scolding us like words of stupid. Do you agree my friend? Uh, I do agree with yours because I think that even a parental support can be one of the factors contribute to a good performance but not the most important factors. How? Because there are some students that are lack of parents. If they are start, if they live in the orphanage and others, how can they get the parental support from them? This, if there are lack of parental support, this doesn't mean that they can't perform well in their examinations. Therefore, I think that an experienced teacher is the most important factor which contribute to the good performance in examinations. An experienced teacher will know the different ways or the interested ways to teach the student how to study the subjects. For instance, an experienced biology teacher will know that draw some diagrams or a colorful diagrams can help students understand better during the teaching lessons. Do you agree with me, my friends? I, I partially agree with you. Some of the teacher is uh, very responsible, but some of them not. They will just ask you to uh, learn, learn yourself or behave yourself in the class. They would teach us uh, much things. So I think that um, parent, uh, parental support is very important. Uh, so they can contribute to good performance in examination. This is because of if a parent is well educated, they can also, uh, they can help the children in their study. Um, if they face, if they don't understand some questions, they, they can just ask their parent and not uh, not throw the <laughs> paper into the dustbin <laughs> and not finish the question. <laughs> I don't agree with you, candidate A and candidate. D. This is because if you do not have a parent or, a, or an experienced teacher to teach you or to help you, you can have uh, self disciplines on helping yourself to, and control yourself to, have a, uh, to contribute to good performance in examinations. This is because you have 
a good time management and control yourself well and you will not neglect your homeworks and do not only focus on uh, studies but also in exercise or sports. Do you agree with that? No, I totally disagree with you, candidate six. I do agree that the self disciplines because we are still students, we need a person to guide we all when we are still for our studies. If we no need the teachers teaching us in the class, then why for we go for school? Do you agree with me, candidate B? <laughs> I agree with you. Because the experienced teachers are teaching us a lot of things during our, during our lesson. And if we have some expression we don't understand in the lesson, we also can ask them and they will answer us correctly so that we can, we can more understand what the lesson are talking about. And experienced teacher also will to help us in the assignment or work because there are there must be do this type of assignment many years and they know the marking skill of the assignment so that they will they will tell us how to done the assignment to get the higher marks so that we can have more good results in the presentation. All right, let's talk about the self-discipline. Um, I think that the self-discipline <laughs> can contribute to good performance in examination. Uh, if the student just want to entertain themselves, um, so there are no way to learn and to, to achieve succeed in life. So the self-discipline can help us to control the time uh, very well and we don't waste time doing something unnecessary. Uh, do you agree with me? No, I, I don't agree. I still think that if a person has self-discipline, I do not deny that the person will study on their self. But if the person lack of an experienced teachers to teach them, how can they solve the problem and know about the topics easily? Any comments can be see? If you do not have self-discipline, then how you study yourself by yourself and your mom is not controlling you? Do you agree with candidate? <laughs> I cannot deny that we need a self-discipline, but it's the most important factor is need an experienced teachers. As you say, self-discipline, you can make a timetable and study with the timetable, but an experienced teacher can tell you how we study. If you are not a discipline, not a self-discipline student, then you will not concentrate in the class. So, you, don't you think that self-discipline is very important? Experienced teachers will make you totally concentrate in the class because you think that the ways and the means she teaches in the class is very interested for you. No, do you think that every time you get an uh, experienced teacher? How do you make sure that you become a self-discipline person? So, you must have parental support in your yeah. life. <laughs> Although we make a timetable, but if you don't follow the timetable, it's, it's very uh, un, uh, not useful for us. So we need parental, we need our parents to control us and just force us to follow the timetable, although we are not interested. No, nowadays the parents are always busy with their works and others. They have not much time to care about their children. They just throw some, a lot of money for them to buy something, to buy just buy a lot of reference book, but don't care about the student who study or not. <laughs> Any comments can be me? <laughs> <laughs> Here influence is the most important factors which contribute to good performance in education. Because friends will help us a lot in our study life and 
during exam we also can study together like uh, like doing some revision together so that we can go so we can enhance our subject before we go to the go to the exam. Okay, stop.